coming up next, imagine calling long distance for free. We'll tell you how and whether those new internet phone plans will save you money. The number of people who turned in their regular landline phone for an internet phone more than doubled last year. 9% of U.S. homes now get their phone service over the internet, taking advantage of this brand new technology. But are they taking advantage of all the hidden savings that could come along with it? Well, this morning we're joined by consumer correspondent Elizabeth Leamy, who is now back from maternity leave and looking great in Gaithersburg, Maryland, <laughs> to help walk us through the ABCs of these phones. You look great, Elizabeth. Great to have you hey, back. Hey, thank you. Thank you so much. All right. Well, there are two ways to talk over the Internet. One is using a basic little converter box like this. You can turn your regular home phone into a web phone. You can also talk right over your computer using the speaker on the computer or using a headset like this. And either way, you will probably lower your phone bills. This may look like a traditional telephone, but actually it's a money-saving Internet phone. Hey, how you doing? New Yorker Ian Warren uses the web phone company Vonage. For $14.99 a month, he gets 500 minutes to keep in touch with family and friends all over the world. So I think it's about $600 a year that I'm saving by using Vonage over a landline phone. We shopped around and found a traditional phone company charging $43 a month for unlimited local and long distance plus typical extras like call waiting. A similar service from a cable company was advertised at $85 and up because you have to purchase premium TV channels to get the phone service. The leading company offering internet calling charges $25 a month for unlimited calling. That's on top of whatever you pay for your high-speed internet connection. And finally, there's computer calling, where you talk over your computer. If the person you're calling has the software on their computer, too, even international calls are free. Or you can pay $2.50 a month for unlimited calls from your computer to regular phones. I think it's a foregone conclusion among telecom companies that at some point all telephone calls are going to go over the Internet. With Internet calling, you can even sign up for what's called a virtual phone number. Your friends and family dial you on a local area code and pay local prices even if you live across the country from them. I'd say across the board it's been a good thing for consumers. But before you unplug your landline, you should know that not all web phones come with 911 service. Or you may have to register your address so emergency crews will be able to find you. Plus, if there's a power outage, your phone goes dead too. But Ian Warren likes his web phone. To me, it's a no-brainer. And loves the savings. When web phones first came out, people complained that the audio sounded tinny. So we're going to turn down my microphone and turn up the sound of me talking over the phone. And it should sound pretty much like a traditional telephone press that really improved the technology. It does sound. It does sound good. This is really interesting. Thank you, Elizabeth. But I'm more interested in something else. Eight weeks ago, a beautiful little baby came into this world. Everyone knows you've been on.